so we're heading up here. Here's Emily there, making her debut. So this is the, uh, the gate, 304. It's packed, as you see. We got eggs, two eggs, a bunch of little sausages, toast, butter, and then he has two croissants. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Yep. Oh my god. Yeah, this is a beautiful view. Wow. Yeah. This is beautiful. What is it called? Yeah. Alright, here's mine. And there's Emily's. I win. She's not too happy with hers. They have black eyes. But mine looks uh, quite nice. You can share. No sharing. No sharing. I picked this. Hello everyone. I want you to join me in another adventure on Celtic Mick Walks. Today, I'm going to take 26 hours of traveling. So it's right now, it's Thursday evening. The bus is coming at 7.30 in the evening. And we have 26 hours to get to the next location, which is Azerbaijan. So I'm really looking forward to it. It's gonna be a long trip. We're gonna be up at the airport for a few hours, waiting around till it opens up. Then we're going to Frankfurt. Frankfurt, we have a four hour delay or stop over there. So we get to walk around, see what it's like in the uh, the airport there um, and then get something to eat and then we go and we're also taking a new uh, airline I've never taken before the Fuenza so we'll see what that's like see uh, if it's worth the you know the money paid for it but I got it on a good budget using my little VPN and I changed the location to uh, India when I was booking it so for myself and my partner so she's coming along for the first time so she'll be making a few cameos she doesn't really want to be in all the videos but I'll trying to get her in a few times anyways uh, we're gonna see a lot of places I have a whole itinerary booked up um, so for this one we're going to show a bit of the voyage getting up there to Azerbaijan we're gonna be collected uh, by the uh, the hotel that we booked and with the booking.com I got an amazing deal so for eight nights with bread and breakfast and it's an upgrade it's a supposed to be a four star we'll see what that's like it's costing me around 460 Azerbaijani uh, manat which comes to about 230 euros so that's an amazing deal so we'll see what that's like when we get into the hotel a little bit later so stay with me and we'll enjoy the ride okay so it's about 10 20 we stopped at the little shop at the uh, where the car park is where if I if you watched my vlog on the hitchhiking the first one and the part of the second one that's where I stopped and I had a quick beer um, so now we're here till I think the security opens up at uh, it's about three o'clock in the morning but our flight is until 550 so uh, these are all just arrivals and we're going to uh, departures later on so we're just gonna go use the facilities and we're gonna you know find a place to chill out we bought some sandwiches I brought uh, don't know if you ever had this but uh, it's a it's a Canadian slash I guess American special is uh, peanut butter and jam uh, so I'll have a couple of sandwiches there but a crisps and a cream soda we're gonna have that um, while we wait and then once we get through security at about three o'clock in the morning we'll stop by and we'll get something to eat I might stop by the old off license and we'll pick up some uh, some cigarettes or fags or uh, for Azerbaijan and I might buy a sneaky bottle of whiskey there because I don't know what the uh, facilities have we'll keep it in the room for the week you know while I'm sitting there editing maybe have a tip or two we'll see find out let's see if we do that okay, so we're heading up here here's Emily there making her debut one one little interesting fact is uh, in 12 years of a year we would never been foreign We've only holidayed around Belfast and around Ireland. So this is the first time we're actually taking a flight and we're gonna be away for and so we'll see how that lasts for the eight days. So stay tuned and watch and we'll see how that goes. Alright, so it's uh it's 236 now. Didn't have any sleep and we slept a bit on a couple of chairs on sideways there up uh, by the Burger King. Um I don't know, I think the uh porches might be opened. I thought it only opened at three, but there seems to be people going through. So she's just going to have a quick uh, sneaky smoke and then we'll go through the security and then we'll get into uh, 
the gate size. Our plane's not till uh, 5.50. So, we'll see how that goes. Here's what it looks like, 2.30 in the morning. Well, that was painful, so we walked right through. It was open early, uh, breeze right through, so here we are. Heading off towards um, see if the uh, duty freeze open, and if not, we'll uh, get something to maybe snack on for later. We'll see. So this is the uh, the gate 304. It's packed, as you see. A little bit ahead of time, but better be early than late. Good morning. Thank you. Good morning. Hiya. Mostly they have restaurants there. Okay, so we're into the next building. It has B19 to 60, so we're looking for B30. Now, the man said there were supposedly restaurants and stuff to eat, so I don't know, it looks like a shed. Let's see if we get something to eat here. See, so it's not too far, it's just down that way. Now we're gonna on a hunt to see if we can find somewhere to eat. We're not going to go to the uh, business class lounges. That looks like muffins and coffees and fruit. Here's the duty free. I wonder how we did on prices. Let's go take a look at that. I bought a one liter Powers whiskey for 27 euros, which is very good. Let's see what they cost here. Oh, Jameson here for 32.90, 33. 25. So I think I did okay with mine. Okay, so we found a place. Deli Brothers. Prices. Uh, kind of on the pricey side. A German for two, 46 euros. Um, most of these are 17. I'm going to go with the Nuremberg Connection, which is uh, fried eggs, a sausage, and toast and butter for 17 euros. And I'm going to try one of their draft beers, uh, uh, draft wheat and beer, uh, 680. Full entire flight. Now I'm going to be talking here. There she is. Have her double latte. It only costs 680. And mine was about six. 690 for the uh, the beer. So we'll give this a shot while we wait for our breakfast to come. It's nice. Very fruity and weedy. It's it's nice. Uh, it's a light beer. So we might have another one of those before we head off. We have we had it's 10 a.m. in the morning, but we have till uh, two o'clock till we flight leaves. So we have one o'clock to be at the boarding. So we have a uh, four hours to kill. Here it's arrived. We got eggs, two eggs, a bunch of little sausages, toast, butter, and then we have two croissants. So we'll see what this is like and we'll dig in. So we'll give these sausages a try with the uh, mustard. Very good. 
now just finishing off the eggs and that the toast. And we'll try to kill four hours. So that was all said and done. I'm still working my way through the beer. I want to be getting to one. I don't think I'll have to be up for two. Um, so I'll let you know how much this whole costs when I get to go. Okay, so here is the damage. Uh, tip, I gave 10%. It was 44 euros in total for the meal. It was a good meal, granted, you know, when you're in the airport, so it's not bad. Well, we're getting ready to board for the final fight. It's not too bad. I had a little uh, sleep here. The benches here are comfortable, a lot more comfortable than in uh, Dublin. Uh, so I was able to lie down and go to Kip for a bit. Um, Emily's running into the smoke room to have the last smoke before we get going on it. And uh, so next stop will be in uh, in Baku. So looking forward to that. We'll see what the fight's like. So we got through the boarding part, but then now we're on a bus. We have to wait to take it off. So people were rushing to get up, but there was no reason because we're all going to be on the same bus to get to the airplane anyways. So the priority boarding doesn't really matter. Okay, so we're all boarded. Now, not as organized as Ryanair. It's all helter skelter getting in. There's a lot of people putting in their luggage that's supposed to go underneath the seats and coats and that into the lockers. And then people are getting in. They're not. There's no room to put the the carry-on luggage. So that's one complaint to have. But the seats are more comfortable, and you get a pillow and a little blanket. So that's a plus. Uh, the seats are a little bit more comfortable than the last one. So we'll see how that goes. The world I used to know, I see it differently You woke me from a dream, now here's reality Baby, baby, you are really hurting me Cause every time you tell me I'm good and bad, I'm doing fine But nothing ever changes Okay, so we arrived uh, 20 minutes late. I spoke to the driver. I did the uh, Aero, Aero app for this eSIM. That worked fine. And I, he contacted me by uh, WhatsApp. We sent each other pictures so we know what each other looks like. So now we're just walking in. So we started this journey 7 p.m. yesterday. It went dark, then light, and then now it's dark again. So now we're just gonna go through customs. I'll turn the uh, 
GoPro off for that and uh, then we have to find the uh, ATM and our driver. All right, customs was done. That was pretty uh, painless. Yeah, it was, uh, I'm not talking to you. <laughs> oh. There you go. Uh, so we got through the visa, so it was quite quick actually. There was a lot of desks operating. Take your photo and they stamp your passport. That's it. Mm -hmm. Now we have to find uh, the ATM and the, and the driver. Nick. Azir. Azir? Yes. Where is the ATM here, Azir? ATM yeah. only is. Uh, There's mostly one in the first floor. Yes. Is it a. ATM uh, airport is inside now. No? Outside is yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Is that ATM here, no? Oh yeah. Money exchange. You want money exchange? No, no. There, there's an ATM there though. But ATM is RBB. RBB exchange. Oh. RBB is. No. Oh, okay. Well, we'll listen to you. Yes. You know better than me. So. You better know better. <laughs> <laughs> that was a long, long day of traveling. We left our home yesterday, seven o'clock at night. So. Yeah, the flight was good. You are from Frankfurt? Uh, no, I'm from uh, Ireland. Ireland. Yeah, we just came from Frankfurt there. Oh, it's nice and cool. Oh, that's nice. They got buildings over there. Wow, it's nice. There we are. Just in. We made it. How many days, Paku? Um, eight nights. Eight nights? Yeah. Oh, too much. It's good. Yeah. You can telephone. Uh, no. Yeah, my work. Yeah, yeah. I got. Okay. Uh, I got an eSIM. eSIM? Yeah. Mm, okay. Roaming? Yep. Yeah. Uh, I have like I think two gig, uh, two gigabytes for two ten gigabytes? days. Yeah. And enough? then yeah, it'll be enough because I'll use a lot of uh, Wi-Fi. A nice building. And I will just go find our uh, taxi and head towards the, uh, the hotel. I think my battery is at, that's okay, it's 39%. Here's what it looks like on the outside. It's cool, eh? Oh, very good. Here's our right. What? We're just gonna be looking for an ATM. We're on the highway here. It's one, two, three, four, five lanes on the side. It's pretty big. So now we just have to find an ATM, get some money out, and we'll head to the hotel. Okay, so got the uh, Manat. I took out, I had to take out 200 times three, so I got 600 there. So we'll have to get some more tomorrow. I have to. That was a little crazy driving around there. It's a lot, very busy. Um, so it was 30 minutes. Uh, we gave an extra 20 because he was waiting here for I think about an hour but uh, we're waiting here for the receptionist it's a really nice area I notice all the buildings when you're driving in they all have these light features everywhere and it really jumps out at you we're really in a great location the, uh, the flame towers are just over there we're right in the center of all sorts of things there it's it should be a good place to uh, see around there so I'm looking forward to this we'll just wait till the receptionist comes and then we'll go check in and then I'll do a room tour okay so the manager came to get this he dropped this off and we've there's a change in the plan so we're actually being moved to an apartment right around here so it's it's a it's a great central location so we'll get there we'll walk there and we'll see what it's like from which city yeah I don't remember really I don't know, it could be anywhere. Like when I was in Nepal, I met uh, somebody that was, that was in our place, Wexford, and he was in Limerick too, working there in the kitchens. So, it's a small world. First time in Azerbaijan? First time in Azerbaijan, yeah. I'm sure you will like. I I looked I looked a lot on it and I I think it's really nice. It has a lot of things that you can see and do. 
and it's really close. The only thing is I want to go to the uh, the fire pits and there's a tour that you can get in the fire pits, no? Yeah. So that's the only thing I want to do outside. The rest is all around Baku, so. Yeah. Make sure you pin the address on your phone and also download your Google Maps. Yeah. So that you'll have the map area. So even if you don't have Wi Fi, you can. Yeah. That's very nice. Yeah. We have a balcony and everything, so that'll be nice. Come on. Still got it? Run, run, run. Run, 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 run. We still got it. There we go. Look. Old city, yep. old town. Nizami Street. Yeah. Old popular yeah. famous place. And between uh, old town, between Nizami Street. Yeah. This building. No, it's very good. It's a perfect location. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get upstairs and we'll show off the room and do a proper room tour. We go in. Oh, it's warm in here. Nice. Very yeah. nice. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Yep. Oh, my God. Yeah, this is a beautiful view. Wow. Yeah. This is beautiful. <laughs> very good. Very, very nice. Uh, this is the Formula One. Oh, the Trust. Formula One comes here on yeah. September, eh? Yeah. Oh. This would be very expensive in uh, September. Yeah. Very expensive. <laughs> like a ticket. Yes. This is beautiful. Very nice. And then we have the bathroom here. And there. Yeah. Oh wow, yeah. Very good. Oh, noodle sandwich. Very good. There's a breakfast. Uh, yeah, place. super. Nice. Oh wow. Very nice. Oh. Yeah, this is very, very nice. It's also working. Yeah. Okay, so I'm walking around there now. I uh, just changed the battery. We've. Oh, did a walk around of the uh, flat for the first time, uh, getting her bearings fit. Now, it's, uh, it's her own private place. The balcony is amazing. The bed's fine. Um, here, we'll have to cross over. Where are you going, Em? Why not? There's ATM here. I would, just when the car's view, it's all one way. No, I would definitely use the virtual company. Let's, let's try this. So we're just walking along. We're going to try to find something to eat. If we do, I'll turn it on. If not, that'll be the end of the first day. There's a lot happening in Baku. Uh, we're going to be exploring all over the place. Today, we're just going to find something quick to eat. Go back and upload the videos and chill for the rest of the night. Been 26 hours. Actually, more traveling. So, we'll get something here quick and then get back to the. On this place, I'm gonna go in and see what it's like. Where do you wanna sit? Yeah. Sure. Thank you. 
Well. It's hard to know, it's just that it's... This is going to be fun. There's your pizzas. Soups. This is soup. And that's your pizzas. Only pizza. Yeah, Only pizza? Yeah. You don't want to hear the margin. What is it called? Yeah. All right, here's mine. And there's Emily's. I win. She's not too happy with hers. They have black olives. But mine looks uh, quite nice. It was share. No sharing. No sharing. I picked this. It came with some fries, some sort of paprika or chili sauce, and there's ketchup and mayonnaise. I love mine though. Mine's really good. Finish mine. Emily, not so much. Some some chips. I, I like mine. And she's doing really good at that. Just not sure about the sauce. Okay. So, yeah, that's true. So, uh, that was uh, 35 monats, so about 17 euro for two pizzas, the chips, and a liter of Coke. So, don't know if that's a great price tonight. We'll see as we go on. But that'll be a nip for Nate because I'm absolutely bollocksed. It's midnight now here. So, we've been going on for. About 30 hours, so yeah. time to hit the bed. <laughs>